Okay, we are going to start with the eighth question. Eighth question, as you as you can see, it is again you are asked to find the shortest distance. But look at the solid. The solid is a frustum of a square pyramid. It is not a pyramid. It is a frustum of a square pyramid. Now, before drawing, you should know what a frustum is. Now, suppose I am having a square pyramid. Okay, and if I am sectioning the square pyramid using a horizontal plane, and if I am removing the top portion, I'll be getting the frustum of a square pyramid. Okay, I am sectioning this. Using a horizontal plane, I am removing the top portion. The remaining portion is called the frustum. So, if I am sectioning using a horizontal plane, I will be getting two squares. I will be getting a square on top face. I will be getting a square on the bottom face. Now, again, look at the question. The dimensions of this top face and the bottom face are given. The dimension of the top face is 20 mm. The dimension of the bottom face is 50 mm, and the height of this frustum is also given. It is 50 mm. Okay. So, three dimensions are given. Side of top face 20, side of bottom face 50, and height of the first time is also 50. Okay, so first we have to start with the top view and front. So first we have to start with the top view. Top view, the side of bottom face is known, it is 50 mm. So, so you start with a square of side 50 mm. Okay, you draw the slant edges, but it should be drawn very lightly first. Very lightly, you draw the slant edges now. We know the length of the top face is 20 mm. So you draw a horizontal line in between these two lines. You draw a horizontal line in between these two lines such that its length is 20 mm. So first you will be drawing this horizontal line. Then you draw two vertical lines and then you join it. You will be getting the top face. Okay. So first I drew the bottom face. I drew very light lines. Then I will be drawing a horizontal line of 20 mm such that it is coming exactly in between these two lines 20 mm. Two vertical lines and then join it. You will be getting a, a square of side 20 mm. You join that darkly. This portion also should be drawn darkly. So this is how you will be drawing the top view of a frustum. Now the height of the frustum is given 50 mm. So you project this point. You draw the axis first. Okay. I will be drawing the axis 50 mm. We know this length is 20. So from the center you have to take 10 and 10 on either sides. So you take 10 mm on this side. You take 10 mm on this side. Then you join these two points to these corners. I will be joining this point to this corner. I will be joining this point to this corner and you join it. Okay. So this is how you have to draw the top view and the front view of the frustum of the square pyramid. Okay. In the next section I will be explaining how to draw the development of this frustum. Okay. 